Hello guys, this is Tech H with an app review, and um, these are one of my favorite apps. Um, over time, we're going to go through them, but um, in here there's one of my favorite apps, and it's really cool. Um, and it's not Facebook or YouTube, so it's one of the Pandora, the Vuzu Horn, and the um, Glow, or the Ring It Up. And today, it's uh, Ring It Up. Ring It Up is a cash register um, built into your iPod touch iPhone and it will it doesn't like support iPad but it will work on the iPad with the two magnification thing um, but you know I'm sure in the upcoming days it will be for you know the um, the iPad and I feel like that should be a good thing because you know essentially if you're just a person that doesn't really want to buy and uh, a cash register and you have an iPad laying around well I don't think people just have iPads laying around but you know saying if you have an iPad your kid has an iPad pay your kid they get a new iPad you can get them a new iPad you get the full version of this which is like 40 bucks and I'm definitely not spending 40 bucks but if you're in demand for it I'll find a way to get it um but if you're in demand for it like I said I'll get it but um I don't know if there's what versions they have but um it will um you know you can use that as a cash register and um it, it's a very nice uh app it's made by pong i think software and um it's just it, it's a very nice app and this one is free but it only lets you have five, it lets you do everything else unlimited, but you only can have five sales at a time. So this is the main home screen. This is how it starts up. It starts on sales, not um, POSs, but it starts on sales, and then it has this in quotes, and, you know, you can add a new customer, and we'll go back to adding a new customer. You can organize it by the date, ticket, contact, payment status, flags, and then you can you know, make that go away. Any expenses that you use on your company, and um, you can add expenses. And like I said, it's unlimited. I think I don't think there's a certain amount because you can only usually do five. Yeah, there's no certain amount. Contacts. Um, you can add contacts from your address book or suppliers, or you can even add new ones or all together. And you can organize these. Um, you know, I think in in expenses you can organize them. Goods, services, and um, as far as goods and services, you can organize them. You can add a new good and everything. Um, and more reports, you can see, you know, all the reports of today and inventory and settings. You can see financial settings and, you know, who's the phone relate to and email settings. It'll email the bill and everything to the person, which is really nice. You can edit it to whatever you want. So if I want it settings down here, which I don't think is going to happen, um, you can do that. So let's go into sales, and we'll do this one. And you can have it as far as um, the contact. You can find the contact, or you can make it a walk-in customer. And um, that that's pretty cool. You can um, have the email app. Um, you have to have an email app for this. It doesn't have its built-in email app, but it'll tell you which ones it works with. Um, yeah, you're ready. Whatever, and it'll do that. Um, you can flag the customer for special reasons. Sale item. Sale item payments. Um, you can make it by cash other. Um, method. If you hit method, you can make your own method. Uh, notes. You can make it private so it doesn't send, or you can make it a note, which I suggest you don't use because if the person gets it and then they might get the note, then yeah, you yeah, lost the sale. <laughs> and then you have your subtotal and everything, and then you have discounts. You can anything in blue, you can usually edit like other charges. You can make it instead of other charges, you can make it say whatever you want. Um, discounts, tips, you can uh, change the sale rate or the sales percent. You can add items together, so you can add, it'll say how many quantities, so I want three quantities of that, and hit save. 
and of the new item, and then the balance, and then a note. So that's done with that. Expenses, you know, you can clone the item, the date, what it is, the category, and everything. And um, with categories, you can add categories, so test and everything else. Um, suppliers, you know, you can add a new supplier, and you can import from contact. You know, um, you have any of them and everything. Um, a new company, a name, an address, email, phone, you know, override sale and everything. Products, straightforward. You can make it a good or a service, whatever. Um, with the new, we're not new apps, but with the paid version of the apps, you can actually scan the barcode with the iPhone camera and um, it'll like take the picture of it and use it in the database and everything else so you can use everything on it. So I'll scroll through this really slow so you guys can see this. So, and then there's usually anything in an edit. And then, like I said, reports, inventory, and everything. And then here's this, and detailed, and everything. And it'll even email it to you. So, sales. And you can have it so only today. And here are your sales and everything. And you can say send, and it'll say print app or email business. Um, settings. What's your settings? What's who's this phone belong to? Um, this is like it's still in a working progress, but for the free version. Financial settings, you know, this and you know, apply tax to labor and stuff like that. And you can turn off and on stuff. Email settings this you know just what the headers and everything you want it to be and you can even add your own logo and stuff like that and um just just things like that you can do um sync document services buy it up or buy ring it up and data transfer export to data and you know user guide and like i said it's made by uh ping software so i hope you guys enjoyed this app review and i'll hope to do it or hope to do more soon well, I don't hope to do it. I'm going to do more soon. Um, there are three versions, so at the end I'm going to put all three versions, and you can go check them out for yourself. Um, they're all called Ring It Up, but there are certain things that you can do with it. And it'll even tell you in the description, not my description, but in the App Store description, what uh, credit card companies it works with, or credit card apps it works with. So, till next time, this is Tech Age with another iPhone app.